The new year very often brings with it a resolve for resolutions and a desire to plan out the year. And though that resolve reduces in intensity as the months go by, the need to plan is highly relevant. Psalm 104 is said to be another type of creation account which is laid out in a very poetic way. It talks about the foundations of the earth, the sky, the sun, moon, stars, mountains, valleys, sea creatures and everything else that's beautiful in nature. But verses 6 to 16 particularly talks about the waters. In verse 9, it talks about the required boundaries set for the waters without which it would bring about chaos. And this is in reference to the flood account in Genesis. But when the waters are organized and set within bounds, then it flows between the hills. Animals are able to quench their thirst. Birds drink from it. Grass and trees grow. It enables agriculture and leads to flourishing for everything around because it has been channelized well. The metaphor can clearly be used for our time and energy. If we are unplanned and unorganized, then just like the floods, there is a potential for chaos. But if we are able to channelize our time and energy well, then we will inevitably be productive and a blessing to those around us. The quote often attributed to Benjamin Franklin and later Winston Churchill is this, If we fail to plan, we plan to fail. Though a little extreme, it does point to the necessity of it. None of these leaders just got up one day and decided to lead the nation. Their actions in history is a product of intentional planning, organizing and executing. Regardless of what one does in life, planning is a skill that cuts through all of them and is a basic necessity in every sphere of life. And each person has to be able to come up with a system that can help them. I personally use a physical diary. Trello, ClickUp, Evernote and then integrate it all with Google Calendar. And that's a system that has sort of worked for me, but it constantly needs to be updated and reworked. So the specifics of it needs to be tailor-made for each person, but the principles remain the same. Nations that have succeeded in the long run are those who have carefully and meticulously come up with a good system of planning. It immediately creates a very defined boundary and those within it are able to flourish. So even if you are one of those who believe that any way that all plans go down the drain by the end of Jan, I urge you to press on and keep trying. It's worth it. Happy New Year.